paraplegic walks into a bar. <laughs> Think about it. Um, I'm going to do lyrics for a track now. It's about the animal farmism of the Eat the Rich movement. Um, just in case I forget them, because it was written like two, three years ago, I am going to get the other one on the phone. If we eat the rich, we could all afford to buy houses. Think of how much we'd save not needing to pay for food. And you know we'd save it every ounce, season them like a Sunday roast. Unless you do a shit roast, then you need to start seasoning your chicken. Well, well. Anyway, we can make coats out of their skin so that we don't freeze in winter. Save on gas and electricity. Excessivity seems to have done them some favours, so maybe it's our turn. Try not to burn them. Remember to break the ribs from the sternum, and we can skip to the weight we don't need a sermon. Who knows, in fact, we might get superpowers. Hours into digesting with his iron in space programme, suing the NHS and eating with chopsticks. How? Invent the super duper pooper scooper to pick up all of the space dog shit. Then dump it somewhere that does nature some harm. Hold up, it's starting to sound like Animal Farm. Season your chicken. No skipping on the pepper. Keep it clucking as it's cooking. It makes it taste better. Dream of super duper pooper scooper profits in this rich endeavour. This is how the Nazis started when they partied on the graves of their victims. Only they had been folded into power rather than inherited. But then I look at our democracy and think shit it's cemented. How when on serving themselves with no nuisance of protest or opposition, it used to be translucent. But now we see straight through the looking glass, and on the other side is the slave owner's ancestor moon in their ass. The grass looks greener there. Ooh, it seems the grass is greener there, with no consequences for your lies, incompetence or confidence in killing to survive. Old bloody creatures need the sunlight, so let's lock them where it doesn't shine. Take the greener grass for prize. Cut the divide by chipping the total down to size. Wiping out the other side and leave the bodies where they lie. A pastor of vendetta against the disconnected. The discontented rise to make the world be disinfected. And then we start again in this series of inflected. Um. Hmm. What do you call a castrated dog that likes to dig holes? Spade. Yeah. <laughs> 